With these warmer temperatures, Husker fans are saying that it is perfect baseball weather. So I bet you're wondering, what is perfect baseball weather? We'll dive into the science behind Mother Nature and America's pastime. With its northwest to southeast orientation, Hawks Field offers a challenge to its players. Husker games generally start in the early afternoon, meaning that the sun angle will be 45 to 65 degrees above the horizon. It also means that it will be directly in the players' eyes. A few things players can do to block out the sun include wearing sunglasses, wearing eye black, and as well as blocking out the sun with their glove. With temperatures high at the ballpark, that makes these concessions behind me a hot commodity. But what does that mean for the players? Well, the only thing on their mind is how far they can hit the ball. And the name of this game is air density. The less dense the air is, the farther the ball will travel, which means on a humid 90 degree day, a ball can travel 10 to 20 feet further than on a dry 50 degree day, which is the difference between senior Austin Darby hitting a fly ball for a potential out or a home run. The wind always seems to be blowing in Nebraska, but how does it affect the flight of a baseball? NASA's, NASA physicists concluded that even a five mile an hour wind can alter the flight of a baseball by 10 feet. Why? Air friction is the reason. Air friction can either hinder or enhance the flight of a baseball depending on which way the wind is blowing. However, an MLB study concluded that wind has no effect on a baseball at all. So, who to believe? Well, it's up in the air. For Star City Weather, I'm Cody Carlin. And I'm Emily Lockermeyer. Now, if you excuse us, we got a Husker game to watch.